Hello everyone and welcome back. Today we're going to be looking at some Polybridge 2 and we're going to be picking up right about where we left off and that's not where we wanted to go. We didn't want to go to the workshop. Why would we want to go to the workshop? The workshop's got really cool stuff in there. We don't go in there. <laughs> uh, we're going to go do some rock skipping. Uh, you should have seen some of this at the end of the last episode and I was already kind of prototyping what I think I might want to do with it. But I'm not, I'm not 100% on it. Okay, if that spring didn't break, just just imagine that that spring didn't break. Please don't break. Nope, it broke. Exactly as planned. Not my plan, but uh, it's somebody's plan, I'm sure. Uh, no, because we got to do a thing. To go to a thing. To go to a thing, probably. With the thing attached. And boing. Ah! It uh it crushed, but it didn't collapse. Okay, we're stretched there, which is good. We're already stretched there, so it shouldn't go oh no, wrong way. Twenty percent compr oh twenty percent is way too much. Ten percent compressed. I like that. And for you, we're going to go 10% compressed. What happens? Oh! It goes slightly different. Just exactly as I thought it would, as far as you know. And boing! Okay, so the problem here was that. That support was in not quite the right spot. And that's definitely going to break again. Uh, what if we did that? Is that a better angle for it, maybe? Hmm. Well, let's see. How far does it... Okay, I'm going to zoom in a bit to see exactly where it goes. Does not go far enough. Okay. No dice. Um, let's see. We can see if we can get a little bit more range out of it. Uh, let's see. We want one of you out here so we can spring a thing to spring a thing. Straighten that up as good as we can. And that's definitely wrong because it should be compressed. That goes a bit further. Oh, I like that a lot better. Okay, so it makes it out to here. So we just need to find a way to support a road about here. Which means about a lot of elms. Oh, come on. I know you can reach. There we go. We're going to stretch you out as, <clears throat> as much as we can. And then we'll figure out how we're going to support you. Because that's how this game works, I'm sure. Okay, that it's not working. Okay, let's see. We can get you down to there and attach, please. Oh, dang it. So close. Okay, that that's far from the best. And it's far too short. Okay. See, so it comes down right here. So we need a spring of thing or right here. Right? You with me? Do a one of them's and a one of them's and a one of them's. Okay, it's currently holding itself up. Let's uh, pre-compress. Oh, not that much. There we go. Stretched out a little bit. Could take the force a little bit better. Oh, what is it's it's the angle. The angle is absolutely the issue. See if, what if we did that with a that attach, and then spring a thing it off of there. Oh, we can't spring a thing it off of there. Spring a thing it off of there. What happens there? Oh, oh, that's a good look. That's a good look. That's a bad look. <laughs> oh, okay. 
Uh, can I make you reach? I can't. Can I? I can't. Okay. Which means if I go the other way, maybe? Oh, come on. Just light up. There we go. There we go. It holds the shape that it's supposed to hold. And then it breaks. Immediately. But if I can reach it with two of those, I can reach it with one of those. Why? Why did you break? I have no idea why you broke. And then you broke. It's a it's a weird combo of stressors. Broke straight through. Okay. We already know that that placement is not bad. Uh, I kind of like the idea of two. We just have to figure out how to hold it. That looks like that's helpful, but not very. W what happens? That happens. Okay, we can't reach there for sure. Bring a thing it to death. Wait, do we have rope? We don't have rope. Okay. Uh, part of the problem seems to be this thing being as compressed as it is. Try 10. Does 10 work? 10 kind of sort of almost works. Uh, let's compress you. And you seem to be holding a little bit better. How about now? You seem to be holding pretty good. And you still collapse in the middle. We gotta come up with some kind of way to connect you up. Like that. So, that metal bar should not be holding a lot of stress. That doesn't fix it. That doesn't fix it at all. Hmm. I may test some stuff out and then uh, come back to you. Aha! There we go. Finally came up with a solution and it's time to share. Okay. So... This is what I came up with. Took a lot of trial and error. Apparently I was going far too short on this first bit. So it wasn't getting quite far enough. So this right here is a red herring. Okay, here we go. Oh, and, oh, and there we go. <laughs> oh, okay. Next one. Support cable. How does this... What? Uh, what? Look, oh, it's only cables. Interesting. Maybe it's time to chase it. Chase it good. Okay. That looks pretty good. Let's uh, fill you. What happens? It hasn't fallen apart yet. That's always a good... Uh, that's bad. That's bad. That's pretty bad. Okay. We've got a lot of metal cable. And boom. And I wish, 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 wish. And we're over budget. What happens now? It still breaks. Okay. Not a surprise there. Mm, but it still kind of needs to be a hanging bridge. However we decide to do it. Let's uh, adjust our shape here. A little bit further down, see if we get a little bit more length out of it. So it's got a little bit more play in it. And we're going to fill you with uh, these. Oh wait, nope. That's, that's, mm, well, let's see. Gotta give it a try. Oh. Oh. That was not as big of a failure as I expected. Yeah, it's definitely still too steep. Okay, let's fix you to about there. And actually fill you with something this time. Yes, please. There we go. And... Wait, we've got regular... Why is this even a thing? Okay, uh, we're gonna go back to straight. We're gonna fill you with regular roads because I'm I'm betting we can do that. And then we're going to do this little number here. Up, oh, get you connected. Copy. Please 
disconnect? Oh, dang it. They're not perfect. You know, I bet if we turn on the grid, everything snaps together like it should. Yeah, the grid comes, comes in kind of handy occasionally. Why is that one leg longer? What? Was that the problem? Is it because it's not top center? Okay, that looks pretty darn even. It's kind of working. Oh, and I did the wrong thing. There we go. Now what? Immediately fall apart. Not a surprise. Uh, let's do one of these. On each side. And then connect it up with, you guessed it, a cable. Look how much load that took off the top. Okay, okay, so it's not perfect. Nobody said it was perfect. I might have said it was perfect. No, I didn't. That's a lie. And that's not going to hold the darn thing up. Let's distribute the load a little bit. And do one of these. And then connect these up. Okay, stress-wise, it's looking pretty okay. And break. Okay. What can we do to prevent you from breaking? I wonder if this is an option. It really just needs to have some spacing, right? And I, I gotta I gotta believe that, that steel cable is a little bit stronger. Oh the road broke? Oh okay, 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 okay. Let's do 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 do. More weight, more strength, more better. Still technically under budget. Oh, and we broke. Uh, it was this guy that broke. I don't want to do the uh, the muscle shape all that much for this, but whatever works. Yeah, I, I immediately saw that that was under too much stress because it's uneven. Okay, what was your problem this time? Let's straighten you up a little bit, see what happens. Instantly less stress. But keeping straight angles and stuff helps a lot. What broke that time? Yeah, this side. Not a surprise. Once again, muscle to save the day. I mean, I was calling it double diamond until some folks started calling them muscles. And, you know, double diamond... I kind of like a little bit better. What broke? Come on, tell me what broke. Oh, this guy? I don't want to do that the whole way across. But at the rate we're going, we may actually have the budget for it. Actually, I can probably save a little bit of budget by centering these a little bit. And every bit of budget saved is a bit of weight saved. We're getting there. We're absolutely getting there. Uh, let's do this number and see if that changes where the stress is. Oh, so close. So, 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 so close. Uh, yes, that did in fact change where the stress was. So I think we can do this now. We have lower overall stress before starting, which is a good sign. What broke? Uh, another top member? Of course. And yes, before you ask, I probably could go through and uh, do that to all of them. Or put, uh, put more of those underneath. But I think, I think it may not be necessary. Okay, what broke this time? A road segment? I hadn't had one of those break in a minute. Let's speed you up a little bit. Uh, same road segment, the other side. Those were always the ones under the most stress. 
and we finally hit a breaking point here. Uh, let's see. We have so many stress points so close together, it may behoove us to uh, and go over a little, little bit over budget, you know? Uh, that ain't gonna work. Well, maybe it would work. Uh, that would... It's just what happens. Tell me what happens. It just immediately breaks again. Which is okay. It is. Uh, that was also one of the ones that was always under a lot of stress. Maybe it was this right there. That may have been it. Just because, like, this other side... Oh, no, don't do that to me. Let's see. And you may be asking why I don't do the same on top. And, like, down here, these these lines. But that's specifically because up top is being pressed together. Down, down on the bottom is not. Okay, uh, we need to save some weight. Let's try this. What happens there? That wasn't the piece that we adjusted that broke. Just saying. And I think maybe if we get a little bit more consistent angle. Actually, I really like this side. And I gotta get rid of all of that. And flop. What was that? Oh, it was... Mm, yes. Yes, yes it is. And we're gonna run into that problem. Come on, no breaks. Please, fingers crossed. No breaks under budget! Aha! There we go! And look at all of these other designs in the gallery that looks like they spent a lot more money than I did. See, I like that one, though. It's kind of what I wanted to do, but that's not what I did. Oh, and I beat Auto Dave again. Don't, don't tell Auto Dave. <laughs> okay. Well, it looks like that's going to do it for us today, guys. I wanted to say thank you for hanging around this long. If you did and you haven't already hit subscribe, please do. Uh, just so you don't miss out on any of the other cool stuff coming on down the road. If you'd like to hang out with us, please hit us up on Discord. Link is in the About section on the channel, or you can go to discord.onesnot.com. And I will see you guys in the next one.